Hello, once again, audience, and welcome back to Domination's yeah. with Mac Marla and Christopher. What and happened there? What happened there? Oh, there we go. All right. I've got some troops. We're in war together. We're in war together. How awesome is that? In our boot camp. Boot camp. Uh -huh. Welcome to boot camp. Right now, it's kind of alt camp. Oh, yeah, it's <laughs> filled with secondaries. It is. That's uh, all right. We're going to get bigger and Baby bigger. secondaries. Baby secondaries. I, I haven't done any scouting for this war. I've been totally negligent. I'm sorry. Uh, it looks like you've got two offensive coalitions, so you should be good. Yeah. The offensive coalitions, Korean strength of the <laughs> Russell Crowe. Chris Crow. said one was too hard, so no. <laughs> he said I was number two. Everybody's everybody's saying that they're recommended as number one, and I'm like, oh, how nice. Aw, pocket knife one. I'm sorry. Uh, I preemptively apologize, but all of our recommended targets are your number one. Oh yeah, they're quite a bit. That's quite the mismatch, I'd say. Uh, yeah, I mean, they've got... Because we're all, like, gunpowder. Oh. Yeah, give and take. Yeah. You're on two. Hit your mirror. I'm on two? Hit your mirror. Did you even scout it, or are you just going? No, I'm scouting. I don't have even a general yet. Do I need to scout? <laughs> oh my. I'm sorry. Isn't that what you say on bases like this? Sorry. Yeah. start. It's almost so bad it's good. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Like, unbeknownst to this person, they've done a few things that are actually really tricky. Mm-hmm. But I don't think they're aware that they've done these things. Mm -hmm. Who knows? Who knows? Alrighty. I'm coming in right here. Watch out for that activation range. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's your activation range on the town center. Right there, eh? Yeah. So, like I said, unbeknownst to this person, they've done a few things that are really tricky. Huh. So you almost have to, like, sab drop force target. Or, well, you know for a fact that he's put something there. Yeah. Right. Yeah, and all these walls. Hmm. Mm -hmm. That's curious, isn't it? That's special. Yeah. Like I said, it's almost so bad that it's good. Mm -hmm. Could also that might be too far for my troops to get in there, though, because, like... They're not that tough. They're not that tough. I find three roses a lot. Oh, uh, with the, uh... With gunpowder. Yeah, with gunpowder it is. That's a push. Okay, so I feel like I only have one choice of entry point. Well... Yes and no. I mean, with that strength of the gladiator, if you were to drop right here, like out here somewhere, you'd be taking that out right away. And then you could do like a sab there. That's still too many rows of buildings, right? That's four rows of buildings if I go out here. Oh, yeah, I guess so. Yeah. 
you know what? If you sap, get your troops down and throw on that strength of the gladiator. I should be okay. It'll go poof. You'll be just fine. Okay. Let's do it. Do it. Let's do it. All right, not picking my face, not picking my face. I even have a brace for my finger, so I don't pick my face, and I still do it. It's, yeah. Horrid, 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 horrid. First war, perfect score. Go get it done. No pressure. Okay. Right. You shouldn't be freaking out, little Miss Korean with, uh, Oh, I'm missing troops. I'm missing some, uh... Some mercs. Some mercs. Um, let's see if I have... Oh. Whatever it is. To get those mercs. Because it was probably... I was probably shy on the side. Is that what you think it was? Yeah, it certainly wasn't the time instead of. Okay, that's looking a little better. Oh, there you have, go. Maybe at this level, my troops will actually do something. Like my coalition troops. Because they're pretty close. Well, they're not even pretty close. But they're closer to my level. Maybe. I find, like... On my IA, they're just like throwaways. They're just like K go and die. They usually like with the Aztecs especially, they're dead before they've done any damage to anything. <laughs> it's like wow. I guess it's I guess maybe it can be considered a extra decoy or something. You can count on them for a farm. Not even. Really? Not even. I deployed them and I watched them once and it was like before they even made it to a building, they were dead. Nice. Oh no, I double sabotaged. There goes your extra sabotage. Double sabotage. Oh, see, and already your sabotage has run out. Yeah, it has. So there must be nothing in their town centers. Nothing. Oh, bodes well for you, anyways. Yeah, I kind of. Uh, ha ha ha. That's funny. Look at them caught on the wall there. Snazzy stuff. You silly guy. Let's get those guys going, because, like, I wasted all my, uh... Sabs. Jeez. Oh, what are you doing? Uh, I'm not sure what I'm doing there. I'm, like, making sure everybody dies. Okay. That was supposed to be a speed rally. Oh, was it? Yeah. You just missed? Right, uh, yeah. Like um, the building fell. Maybe it's a good thing you're in the boot camp. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> oh. Yeah, so I can teach you a thing or two. I'm sure you probably could. With the way my attacks have been lately, I am positive that you could. Look at the, like, the Koreans just chew through stuff, right? They do. They're just like, that's nice. <sighs> Unless it's field howitzers. And <laughs> field howitzers make them go poof. Yeah. That, that's about the only thing that stops these guys. Field howitzers. I've taken on howitzers, tanks, whatever pops out of the town center. It doesn't matter. Yeah. But... The old howitzers will eat all yeah. the Too funny. Uh. <coughs> all right. One down, one.
one to go. That's... That was good. That was very nice. It's unusual hitting a base of your own level. It is, isn't it? It is. Um, I mean, I, like even in my war in Last Out Lost 2, um, I was saying, you know, this is this guy's at my level, and it was it was weird. Not attacking somebody that was like a, an atomic 190. I find because I'm lower down on the totem pole, pole. You're a little bit more even keeled. I usually get matched with somebody in and around my XP level, but they're usually global. Okay. So there's the extra buildings that you have to take into account, right? That's the real kicker. Yeah. And the resistance. Mm hmm That's... They tweeted about that today. About uh, betrayal. They said, you know, do you like betrayal? And I was like, uh, yeah. Betrayal's an absolute must if you are an industrial going up against uh, a global. When there's resistance, you have to have betrayal. And a miracle. And a miracle. Usually. Uh, no, I've been really uh, focusing on getting my planes buffed. Um, did you want to just do your boar attack off of this one? Okay, you, is it on there? I, I think your account should still be on here. Oh, yeah. yeah, let's check it out. Because this was your old... My old profile? Your old profile. Yeah. Which just became the gaming profile. Yeah, all of our accounts are on here. Okay, I don't know which one's mine. We'll take a wild guess and say that one. Let's try that one. Yes. It's been a while since I did an attack on this one. Well, I mean, you can flip it over to yours if you want to. Right? Yours is faster. Yours is speedier. Yeah. Yeah. I think I'm all set. I, uh, I hope I'm all set. Um... I went with defensive coalitions, just on the off chance that these guys do attack. Oh, no, they did. They, they've they attacked. They got one star, one attack. Who did, they th who did they attack? I don't even know. They've got one star, one attack. Hopefully they come out and actually put up a fight. Well, I, I think that it's pretty uh, lopsided in our favor. I think so. And like I said, you know, with this account especially, I'm rarely ever attacking a gunpowder or an enlightened even. Oh, let's see. All right. I'm going to drop a sab there. Go with a double drop there. Uh, likely I'm going to rally right in there. And then my second sabotage is going to go right there. That should give me the quick victory, and then I can just plow through the rest. Ta-da! I don't. I have Korean troops though. I should have just gone with demos with this guy. To be honest with you, because his mortars are all such that they're like catapults. Is that what they're called? Catapults. Yeah. Well, I thought that's what British needed to use rather than sabs, is because they just can't take any hits because they're big babies. They are. They really are. And they just die because I did try to do Chris's war attack. <laughs> that was funny. Was it was quite entertaining. Yeah. Alright, so. I don't know. Like, I kind of feel like British are like taking a knife to a gunfight or something. Maybe it's a sword. I don't know. Because Just kill that right now. There you go. Done. I made the decision, executive decision, to sabotage the anti-tank gun versus the other one. Just because... Well, that catapult is actually targeting, or was targeting, my heavy mahouts. Yeah, they can take a lot, man. They really can. So as a result I of that... I love my mahouts. 
and now we've got that spread. With the British, there's you don't get so much of the speed rallies and grouping, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. You've got to really just kind of go with the flow. Um, Unless you're like pulling your troops away to regroup to go get away from the fire. Right. Um, and that's just not my attack style. I'm like, no, that's nice. Get it. Go get in there. And so. I can't imagine myself ever even trying to be British. It's uh, it's different, that's for sure. But you'll see that they just kind of water through, and you got to just kind of watch. So after that <coughs> strategic initial kind of phase, once that's over, you've got to just kind of go with the flow. And I have a very hard time with that. I have a really hard time with that. I know people that even do like a spread drop. So rather yeah. than dropping in two places, they just literally spread all along the face with nothing but shooters. Yeah. Yeah. And usually that's with the uh, no card attack, I think. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Hurry up. There it is. Five stars. Done. Done. Oh yeah, I see my my uh, diamonds are maxed on this too. Yeah. So I've been fighting to find national trade goods though. So I've been finding people that have diamonds, and as a result, I have full diamonds. But yeah, it's no I do star. on this account too, because um, quite often I don't always five star when I'm out looting because I have my war army. I don't have any heavies. Yeah. Because it's just not a focus. I lost six troops, or six, yeah, six troops. Yeah. There we go. Yippers. After this war, I think I'm going to upgrade my uh, my stronghold on this one. I've modified my home base a little bit, um, depending on how it holds up. I haven't been attacked, actually, in a few days. Oh, I rarely get attacked on my gunpowder. Oh, day one day eight hours ago. Mind I, was you, I probably don't ever have really that much loot, so I probably get passed up a lot. Like, yeah. Not much appeal. No. But there you have it. Yeah. That's fun. There we go. Keep your sticks on, sticks. Uh, keep your sticks on the ice. Have a good time. Try one more time. Keep your sticks on the ice. Have a good time. All right. We'll talk to you guys later.